Your WCBI First Alert AccuWeather Forecast with meteorologist Vanessa Alonzo. Good morning. Thank you so much for joining us here on Sunrise. The time now is 518. We're waking up to cloudy skies on this Wednesday morning. Some of you over parts of the northern part of the WCBI viewing area from Hamilton into Iuka and into Fulton are seeing a few rain showers this morning. Overall, a mild start to our day. Temperatures in the 70s currently. So you know we are in for a warm, humid day here in North Mississippi and West Alabama. I'm expecting high temperatures today to climb up to near 90 degrees. Thanks to a southeast wind that's pumping in a lot of tropical air from the Gulf of Mexico into the region. So you know what that means. We're going to have a lot of humidity in place. So even though those temperatures are climbing up to near 90 today, it's going to feel like upper 90s to near 100 degrees out there with that heat index. We also do have the chance for those usual pop-up showers and thunderstorms in the afternoon. So today, not looking to be a big concern for us with our weather. Heading into the next 24 to 48 hours, that's going to be a different story as we are continuing to watch Hurricane Laura getting its act together over the very warm waters of the Gulf of Mexico. Currently, it's still a Category 2 storm with winds at 110 miles per hour. Now, according to the Saffir Simpson hurricane wind scale, it's only one mile per hour wind away from becoming a major Category 3 storm. And you can kind of see it's trying to form a that center of circulation, that well-defined eye. And when you see that on satellite, you know that means that hurricane is only going to get stronger. So now we are preparing for the possibility that this could be a Category 4 hurricane before it officially makes landfall late tonight into tomorrow morning over the Texas, Louisiana coastline. And then it's going to continue to race up Louisiana into Arkansas and then into the Tennessee Valley region heading into late Thursday into Friday and into Saturday before it races off the east coast of the United States early next week. Hurricane warnings are in effect for parts of the Texas, Louisiana coastline as they're preparing for a major category for hurricane to possibly make landfall by tomorrow morning. Storm surge, look at these levels, could be anywhere from 7 to 12 inches near the Louisiana eastern Texas coastline. Here is the breakdown of how things are going to be looking over the next 24 to 48 hours. So for today, again, us here at home, we have no worries, just a mix of sun and clouds throughout the day. A few pop-up showers and thunderstorms heading into the afternoon, into the evening hours, and then we're all going to be watching Laura as it makes landfall and continues its descent into the Mid-South, which could be bringing us the potential for some heavy rain and maybe the chance of an isolated tornado. Tornado. So keep it tuned to WCBI for the very latest over the next several days. All right, thanks, Vanessa.